In this GTA Online video, I will be showing you all of the best money methods you guys can do after the most recent event week. Of course, we got a bunch of different bonuses and alongside that, some pretty good discounts as well. So without wasting any more time, guys, let's jump straight into this video. And to begin this video, we do have the first money method, which will be the Impulse Export Cell Missions. From the event week, the import export sell missions will have a huge double money and RP. I don't think we have seen the import export business get a bonus money for quite some time. Now, like many other businesses in GTA Online, the import export business will require the office and it will also require you to buy a vehicle warehouse. Luckily, some of these things will have discounts already, so you will not have to spend too much money. As we talk about the payout for the import export sell missions, when you successfully export a vehicle, especially if it is a high-end vehicle you will be able to get two hundred thousand dollars for each one you deliver now if you guys want to get top range vehicles every single time when you source make sure that you check out this other video that i made so long ago this will show you exactly what to do and how to do it essentially you just have to fill your vehicle warehouse with some medium range cars and also some low range cars and every time after that you will only be able to source top range vehicles if you guys want to do the import export business, I would also suggest buying a cargo bob. This will make things very easy when doing a cell mission. You guys can just pick up the vehicle, go pretty high in the sky, and then just fly the vehicle over to the delivery point. But now guys, moving over to the next money method in this video, we do have the VIP work and challenges. Now both of these things will have the three times money and RP bonus, and both of these things will be very easy to start. First of all, just make sure that you guys are in a GTA on online session and then just register as a CEO. Now that you guys are a CEO, you want to go into the Secure Serve CEO tab. And in this tab, you will see VIP work and VIP challenges. You can only do the VIP challenges in a free mode session with other players. But for the VIP work, you can do this in invite only sessions. And in my opinion, this is the best thing to do. Out of all of the VIP work, my personal favorite is Headhunter. In the Headhunter VIP work mission, you will just have to hunt some targets around the map. Now, if you are going to start this, definitely start it when you are inside the city. If you guys start it outside the city, you will have to travel so much further. And also another tip for the Headhunter mission specifically, if you are using the Oppressor Mark II like I am in this video, or really just any vehicle with homing lock-on missiles, if you lock onto a target that is in a armoured vehicle, just hit them twice with the rockets, and after doing this, the target and everyone in the vehicle will exit, and you can just fire another missile on the target to take them out. And after completing this Headhunter mission, you will see that I got a nice payout of $61. $1,000. Now I am pretty sure that this is actually double money in RP on this because if I do remember the standard payout was roughly $31,000 but even just getting $60,000 for pretty much four minutes of doing this that is still pretty good. Also if you wanted to start another headhunter after doing this you will have a 10 minute cooldown on that headhunter and you will also have a five minute cooldown on pretty much all of the other VIP work missions. Not the longest cooldown but still kind of annoying to deal with so in that time I would probably just do the import export business and keep switching between these two and this will bring us to our next money method which will be simeon's export requests these things will have three times money and rp now i could be wrong but i think this is the exotic exports if you own an auto shop you will be able to come up the stairs and see the exotic exports list this will tell you which vehicles you need to get but just remember this is a random event if this is the exotic exports the standard payout for that would be fifty thousand dollars per vehicle you deliver so with it having triple money and rp it will pay out one hundred and fifty thousand dollars every single vehicle but once again guys this will be a random event so you will have to wait in gta online sessions until these vehicles spawn but now guys moving over to another money method now i would actually not suggest you guys do this unless you are super bored or something but this will be taxi work with five times money this might be the first time ever i have seen rockstar do a five times money bonus the only problem with this is it will still pay out such bad money it doesn't really matter what bonus you guys put on taxi work this could be a 10 times money bonus and still be really bad at paying out you guys will see in the gameplay for this first taxi work mission it will be roughly five thousand dollars 
And just remember, if you guys keep doing taxi work, it will go up. Now, I'm not actually sure what it goes up to with this five times money and RP bonus, but even then, this will still be such a waste of time in my opinion. But sometimes it can be fun if you are very bored. So the choice is really down to you. And now moving on to the next money method in this video, guys, we have the Kill Quarter Adversary Mode. This adversary mode will be paying out triple money and RP, and this will be a great choice if you guys love playing with friends and other random players. Having three times money and RP on really any adversary mode will be always good. If you have maximum players in this lobby, you will be able to make the most money, especially if you guys win the adversary mode as well. If you want to start this adversary mode for yourself, just press the pause button go over to the online tab, select jobs, play jobs, rockstar created and then adversary modes and in here you will eventually see kill quota. And finally guys this brings us to our last money method in this video. This will of course be all of the different time trials. The HSW time trial for this week is located at terminal, the standard or default time trial is located at strawberry and then for the other two time trials which is the junk energy time trial and the RC bandito time trial these will change every single day and they will pay out $50,000 every time you do them. Doing the time trials every week is always a great thing to do. I would definitely recommend it for really anyone. It can be pretty much free money if you guys have a fast vehicle. But anyways guys, that will be absolutely every money method you want to do this week. Doing these money methods will make you some pretty good money, especially the import export missions and VIP work. But as always guys, if you went on to enjoy this video or found it useful in any way, shape or form, make sure to leave a like. I really appreciate your support. And if you are new here, subscribe and hit that bell icon to never miss a video finally guys stay safe thanks for watching and i will see you in the next one